Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and today I have a prayer for your community and for mine. Father, we confess that we want to see a change in our lives and in our church so that we can bring about a change in our community. Give us a heart and passion after you that we may begin to see your glory flow out of us and convict and save the lost. Release your presence through us as you have through your saints of old. May the faintest shadow of your presence in our lives heal the sick and restore the and restore the lame that we meet in the streets. Let your presence so saturate us that unsaved guests cannot step into our homes or be around us with unrepentant hearts. May your glory bring conviction in their lives that leads to salvation, not because of the words we say, but because of your presence and power in our lives. So on the basis of scripture, I stand for the leaders of this community. I stand as a representative for other community pastors who desire for three things, repent, request, and resist. We repent. We ask the Lord to forgive us for the sins that have taken place in this province, our state, and our country. We ask for forgiveness for the sins of political corruption, racial prejudice, moral perversion, witchcraft, occult, and idolatry. We pray the blood of Jesus to cleanse our hands from the shedding of innocent blood. We ask for forgiveness for the divisions in the church, for prides, sins of the tongue, or anything else that has hurt the cause of Christ. We repent. And we ask and humbly ourselves before you today and ask for mercy to be poured out upon our land, our city, and our community. We request, we ask for God's presence to come and his will to be done in this community. We ask in Jesus' name for a outpouring of grace, mercy, and fire for true spiritual revival to come and cover this community. We ask for the destiny of this community not to be aborted. We ask that you would visit this community and our churches and our homes. Do not pass this community by. We ask for the restoration of the foundations of righteousness to this city. We also resist on the basis of our submission to God. We resist the devil and all his works, all powers and forces that of evil that have taken hold of this community. We resist the spirit of wickedness that established strongholds in this community, the dark places and hidden works where the enemy has set up a camp. We call on the name of the Lord Jesus Christ right now and the power of the Holy Spirit right now to destroy all spiritual strongholds. We proclaim this day and this community, especially this region, is now under the power, protection, and ownership of the Holy Spirit. All other spirits are hereby given notice and evicted from this community and all godly property. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Through the blood of Jesus Christ, we pray today that, Lord, you would build a hedge of protection around this community, and I pray and declare the righteous free and protected in the name of Jesus. This is a prayer for your community, for your family, and especially for yourself. My name is Robert Dean Steele.